Hey guys, I literally had a mental breakdown this morning. I woke up and the first thing on my mind was my ex and I completely lost it. But then I got it together. I said my prayers. I smoked a blunt and I, I, I don't know. Like I just came back to my senses and I was like, whoa, why do you do this shit? Oh, right. We trying to change our life over here. vlog you guys are coming with me today because uh my brother told me that best buy is an essential store so i'm basically gonna go to best buy and buy a new camera i'm gonna buy a new camera and i'm gonna unbox it then you guys i will be back in my zone i'm gonna be back in my element you guys you're such a fucking hoe i love it i'm ready to vlog bitches you're such a I'm gonna have my computer. I'm gonna have my camera. Ah! Ha! Coronavirus! Coronavirus! I'm telling you, shit is real. So I'm doing um Best Buy curbside pickup, and uh, I got a text message confirming that my order was ready. I'm I'm personally I'm still not ready. Honestly, personally, me. I'm telling my brother to come at 1:30. It's way past 1.30. I just ate. I just had my first meal of the day. And I'm happy that my first meal was not at 6 p.m. Because that's been the quarantine routine. Like, I just don't eat all day. And then, boom, 6 o'clock, I need to eat. So, um, I don't know where my brother is. His screen is kind of like, he can't really text. So, what I'm going to do is take a shower, put some clean clothes on. I don't really, I was going to get cute. But I'm just like... Why? I'm going to put a mask on. This day, honestly, is really, really, really so exciting for me, you guys. Six months ago, I was talking about this with my auntie. Six months ago, I bought my MacBook. And if you guys have been following me on my channel, you know that my life just started to go downhill. And it started with my MacBook in the name of Jesus. Like, I'm sorry. I just, I just, I'm having like an epiphany right now that... If my downfall started with my computer and I already got my computer back, then having my computer and getting my camera, that's like the beginning of an uphill. Do you get what I'm saying? Not even a year has gone by, thank the Lord, and I'm able to purchase my uh, camera. And let's just be honest, I could have been bought my camera, you guys. My priorities just haven't been where they need to be. And I'm growing up and that's fucking okay. But like, I went through this nasty ass breakup and I need to get my mind back. I need to invest in myself. It's about me. And I am just, this is like, I don't know. It's just so crazy because my auntie, she literally stopped me. And she was like, cause I, bitch, I woke up this morning and I had a complete mental breakdown. And I was just like, I cannot keep thinking about this relationship anymore. Like, it's consuming me. I need this shit out of my life. And my auntie heard me having this mental breakdown. And she's just like, there's so much power within you. When are you going to realize how powerful and how strong you are? But I am just like, you guys, thank you for following me. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for just being with me on this journey. Thank you so much for being patient. Because, bitch, I Jesus. All right, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Anyway, guys, we're gonna smoke. Let me go to the store and get water first. All right, I'm gonna catch you guys. So me and my brother almost got robbed. I gotta process this. Like, they really walked all the way up on us and then gave us the option. So you guys can go on. Do you see him down there? No, down there. We must look like squares. It's because we light skin. I promise you, they came up to us, and then they like, "What y'all doing over here? What y'all doing over here?" Mind you, these guys was like forty five years old. I kid you not. Like, why do you want to rob young people? What the fuck is wrong with you? Like, I wanted to say that, but I just got my shit. I just gathered my things and I walked away because I'm like, I looked at my purse. I had my purse wide the fuck open. You can see my phone. You can see my weed. 
I was like, not today, Satan. How you 40 something years old? You decide you gonna rob some young people, but then you don't even do it with your full chest. And then your wingman don't even got your back. Because when I looked in my purse and I looked at them and he just had this look on his face, like he was desperate. Like, And so I got my shit and I held my purse to my chest and I got up and his wingman was like, little mama leaving. Hell yeah, I'm leaving, nigga. You gave me the option. You gave me the option. Do I want to get robbed today? And I chose no. But let me show y'all something. Let me show you how I keep that motherfucking thing on me, though. <laughs> Bitch, I'm not playing. Okay, so I'm here. And they're about to bring my items out. So, very exciting. Now pass it. <laughs> Don't mess it up. Okay. kind of just doing a film test that's what's going on I got my brother over here his birthday is like on Friday and for some reason he's trying to figure out what he's gonna do for his birthday but I keep trying to tell him it's corona times so you can't do nothing you fucking stupid but anyways <laughs> I'm literally so happy to have my camera back like this quality <laughs> Billy, let me get my sunglasses so I can look cool. This camera is definitely not fully charged, but I don't care because I'm excited. I'm a millennial and I love instant gratification. I definitely have to get used to this camera, but I am so excited to have my camera back. Like, I'm a YouTuber, period. Well, all right, how far are you for me? Fucking camera. I don't care if it's dark. Pass some blunt, bro. They must have tried to press it. No, because if you say you're from Harlem 30s, they would have been they would have been like, nigga, if you from 30s, we would have never came but up. But what to if you. I would have took my shirt off and they would have said Harlem 30s, they want everybody. But it doesn't. Know. You don't know that. <laughs> but it doesn't. You don't know that. But it doesn't. You don't know that. Let's ask the audience. I'm just kidding. I didn't run, so I feel good. Niggas Nigga, what you want me to do? Fight them? <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, say the ah, say quality. The say the titties. Okay, guys, I really need to charge this battery. I just gotta be the strongest black man I can be. Okay, so I really need to charge this battery, and then I'm gonna hit you guys up. She's not. I actually might not. He's actually probably correct. Y'all know how light skinned girls are. <laughs> I just feel like we get ready to go somewhere, so you guys are nosy, so I figure I'll tell y'all that we going somewhere. I'm out of here. Bye. <laughs> what are you doing, my sunglasses? They make me look tight. Yeah. No. Delina, Chante, hey. they already started cooking. We literally just got in this bitch. We ain't have no spatula. Okay, so I'm going to end this vlog with a Airbnb tour. I don't really know if people do that. But I don't want you guys talking shit about me, talking about safety, yada, yada, yada. We are under 10 people in this bitch. So we're good. It's my brother's birthday, and we didn't want him to just not do anything. Actually, I'm not even going to lie. I was against it. So I was anti this, but here I am. So... <laughs> Anyways, we're not here to talk about me. I'm here to show you where we are. And um, I really want to upload this video tomorrow. I kind of want to vlog like every single day that I'm here on some fun, quarantine, drunk, family type shit. So I'm going to show you guys around. And yeah, let me start off with the view for you bitches. Clearly, we are in Hollywood. Okay, happy birthday or whatever. I know you on screen time. Okay, now we're going to 
the bedroom bathroom situation i'm assuming it's your room yeah okay i'm really showing y'all like we just moved in here but we're gonna be here for how many days we're gonna be here for two days i'm sleeping in the living room here's the other room my sister she's a blogger hell yeah baby we getting money the pocket's never hungry the other bathroom I want to show you guys the entrance, but I guess I'll show you guys more in another vlog because I'm about to enjoy the rest of my night. You know, I look crazy. My lashes ain't even on. Yeah. You know what? I noticed they like that shit. What? Like when you be on like this. Uh -huh. Somebody left me a comment talking about, thank you for coming on live in a bonnet. I said, I'm going to say my mind. So this is my first drink. And then I'm gonna work on my second. My siblings and her mm -hmm. sibling are outside smoking. That's like her fifth drink, y'all. She over here lying. First. You guys, YouTube is so fucking strict with the copyright stuff. That's why it's been so, people every time they post something, copyright, copyright, that shit. Let me tell you guys something. I don't care. I don't do YouTube for money. I get, I can get money in other ways. I do YouTube as therapy and as a creative outlet. So, YouTube, you're not gonna stop me, bitch. <laughs> like, period. YouTube is like an additional income. It's not primary. So, if it's not primary, that means that I'm not bound to it, which means I could do what the fuck I want. You feel me? Okay, you guys, I've been filming for 20 minutes. With that being said, I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. You think I should vlog tomorrow, or you think we just gonna be on some boring shit? No, you should vlog tomorrow. I'ma see y'all in the morning. Toodles. Till next time. That's what I really be saying. Till next time.